So today, I'm going to show you how to build that. It's a pyramid. And not only is it a pyramid that looks pretty, but you can also put a door on it. Look, I put a door on it. And you can go inside and make it into a base. Simple door thing. You can figure that one out yourself. You do that after you've built it. See? Let's go and have a look inside. Do, 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 do. So I've got a double door. And there wasn't enough light in here when I first did it, so I put a bit of light in. But what do you expect to find inside a fucking pyramid? It's going to be weird, isn't it? Anyway, let's get cracking. Where am I going to build? Let's get up there. This isn't going to be as short as I'd like it to be. Because we've got to do this proper. And thanks goes to Double Dash Gaming for this. All credit to him. I'll put his, uh, a link to his, to his channel in the description afterwards and you really ought to check him out. So, first of all, I've got raises off the ground so you can see what I'm doing. I will, yeah, I'll raise it off the ground. You don't want, to, you don't need to do this of course. Uh, let's find a cube. Is that a cube? That's not a cube. Look, there's a cube. Cubes are always good for raising things off the ground. I'll raise it up here. Uh, we're going with stone, aren't we? Oh, that's wood. Sorry. Stone. I'm just going to slap that on there. I don't have to be precise. So what we're going to do now is build two out from the centre in every direction. Like that. And then turn that into a square. I'm not gonna oh, didn't wanna do that. I'm not gonna fill the floor in completely because I'm gonna be deleting this afterwards, it's just to show you how to build it. Right now, the first thing we've got to do is a wall. So we'll toggle back into the uh, building menu and we choose this stone wall here and we'll go 4i. So it's 2 out from the centre and then 4i. If you want to make these pyramids bigger or smaller I suggest you, get, you, you know, experiment with this, this ratio. See what you can come up with, I haven't got time to do that so I'm not going to do. Hold on, right, back into building mode. Choose the floor. And from the four walls, we have got four walls, haven't we? I haven't done three or anything, have I? Uh, one, two, three, four, yeah, four eye. So four eye, and then we put the floors down, do that. Number three should be directly over the centre. So now we can remove these, this wall, and that one, and that and that and remove these boys here because all we want is that one there so that's what you should have now right okay now back into the building menu and choose small storm wall A because there's A and B choose the A one and put small storm walls all the way around and we want to do this 2i. Not 2i as in uh, that's too much, as in two stone walls I like that. You knew what I meant anyway. There you go. Oops. No need for that bottom one I don't think, but I'm going to put it in anyway because that's just the kind of guy I am. Right, now Press the circle button and it will take us back to the uh, building menu and we're looking for an hydroponics unit, that one there. I hydroponics tray, the large one. That will sit in there perfectly. Just plonk it in there. It's not going to stay there, we're just using it. 
so we can get an exact me measurement so uh, we can get these cables now this is the uh, glitching bit and it's really easy don't let that put you off let's go uh, back into the building menu back to the stone walls and we'll pick uh, oh that's timber again I keep doing that stone wall A we want that right in the centre here see so there so it's about to be placed but you don't want to place this don't place it so you I've just tapped on a triangle so that's your your cable tap triangle again and go back to the stone wall it's ready to be placed now what you do you press this is on the PS4 I think on PC it's a Q button on the PS4 it's a triangle button which is the toggle toggle wire button and you also squeeze the trigger with the index finger which is uh, R2 that's right yeah R2 on the PlayStation 4 controller so you press R2 and the triangle at the same time like this see what you've got there now it's very easy you should have a cable if you don't just do it again until you do have a cable practice makes perfect that's dead center I mean that's exactly in the center and that's what you want to do when you're building pyramids now you attach that to there and you do the same all the way around do the same here place that there let's pull back go back a bit that's it I'm a bit closer up place that there there on top now press triangle and the trigger button R3 at the same time there connected see take that up there and we want to connect it to this one and I connect a bit to make sure I am because that has to be st that's right that's it's got to be straight you see and again put that there triangle and R2 at the same time there if you end up placing the actual wall itself it means you've pressed uh, the trigger before you press the triangle you know by a fraction of a second you should be pressing the triangle before the trigger but only by a fraction of a second place that on there now we'll do this one. Triangle and R2. There you go. And connect that there. Now the only reason you did any of that was so that you could get that cable there and get it facing in the right direction. We can't rotate anymore apparently so so now what you're going to do is you're going to go up here and on the top of this little stone wall here you're going to do exactly the same you're going to build you, well you're not going to build it you're going to put that stone wall there you're not going to place it you're going to press triangle and trigger at the same time and there so I've got that connected there now I can connect that to this point oh, let's just spin around a bit now I can connect it to that point there. I no longer now need that wire underneath this one. Uh, so I can delete that. I will do. Now hold on, where's my little cursor thing? There. Hold on. So, delete that and you do the same with the rest of them go up here let's choose the wall put the wall on top there don't place it just press triangle and trigger at the same time that's got to be a circle you see that there it's a circle isn't it yeah. triangle trigger same time and there you go and connected should be on top of the wall there, yeah, there. 
I'll take that down and connect it to that one. Well, I'm just going to do something. Just better if you can see that cursor. Right, back into build mode. Small stone wall. Let's go in floating mode so I can float over there. We do exactly the same here. Triangle and the trigger at the same time. So I'm going to take this down here and connect it to there. Have we done them all? No, we've got one more to do. This one. There, see how I'm connected to that now. And put that down. Connect it to there. So now we've got all them done, we can delete everything. Not these, not those final wires we just put in, but all the other wires. I'll show you which ones. Let's go into delete mode. There. We want to remove these bottom wires that are underneath now. That one. That one. And... That one. And then all this shit. Tr oh, try not to remove any wires. There. Oh, it's gone dark. It would go dark, wouldn't it? There you go. Now what you do, just the last little bit of glitching. Go into build mode. Get your stone floor. Now tap triangle. And you've got your little cable thing there. Look, tiny little cable thing. Put your little cable thing over the top of there so it turns into a big circle like that. And then press triangle and trigger at exactly the same time. Except not exactly because you're going to press the triangle a fraction of a second earlier. And you should have that at an angle do that here again tap the triangle button to take you into cable mode and there tap triangle put your little cable thing over the top of there and then press Triangle and R2 at the same time. Triangle and R2 at the same time. Yeah, perfect. Now we can't leave them like that because they're in the way. So what we've got to do is we go into uh, the building menu again. Choose a small panel. Stone, pound there, and put it there at the side, and then one underneath. Go into delete by pressing the square button. By the way, that's how you delete things. And squeeze your uh, R, no, L1, uh, L2 trigger, sorry, and that will delete it. There. Now you can go back to the building menu, choose the stone floor, and put it there. That's where you wanted it. And you do that on every one of them. This is the fun bit. Choose a large triangle. Put it there. And now, you can do this. And you really don't need me to show any more because this is just, you just do this. Oops. Let's zoom it there. Just move about a bit. If you can't, if it, if it won't go where you want it to go, just move your camera angle or yourself, just move and try again
You can move these wires afterwards or you can just leave them in place. They're perfectly hidden so that there isn't a problem leaving them there. There. You get the idea, don't you? Re remove them afterwards and you can just go all the way around. Build it all up. Of course, you've got to... Let me just do this one. We'll do this one. Small stone panel. One there. One there. Square button. R2. Uh, I mean, L2. To delete that. Circle button to bring up the menu again. Large floor. And put it in at, at an angle like that. Remove these afterwards, of course. Or you can leave them there, because... I think I've left them in there. They're underground now. And now, get a large triangle. So it just a, it's a piece of piss, really, isn't it, Luke? It's so easy. See? How easy is that? Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Right. I'm going now. 